Hey guys, welcome to another plugin tutorial. Today it's on coloured tags. So this is a fantastic plugin that hooks into your permissions plugin, such as Group Manager or Permissions X, and it has a really awesome coloured tag for players. So you can change the prefix, you can change the suffix, and you can change the name of their no, the colour of their name. So first of all, let's show you the commands. If you do forward slash c tags help, it will show you these. So you can change either the specific groups, prefix and suffix, or a particular player. So I made this one earlier, let's have a quick look at it. You can see I've changed the brackets color and added a symbol on the end. And um, there are lots of symbols, I'll pop them up on the screen and you can choose whichever one you want. So we are going to have a quick go at changing his again. So C tags, player, the player's name. Then in quotation marks, we can do the prefix. So uh, let's make this look nice. Let's put a couple of brackets like that, the uh, circle brackets this time, and it's going to be in the group user, so what colour should we choose? And B, so that's a sign colour. Then we need to put their name in the middle, like this. Um, make sure you do it exactly, or you might have issues. And finally, let's put a, uh, a symbol at the end, so square brackets, plus plus, square brackets. And hopefully, it should look really cool. So as you can see, uh, the colour has affected the name as well. If you want to get rid of that, you can put and R, which resets it. If you do and, um, I believe it's and L or O, it will um, change the format. So as you can see there, that has changed the format to italics. And if we try out and L, that will make it bold. And K, I believe, makes it all squiggly, yeah, like that. So you can actually make. Uh, you can make a group where people can't identify their names, which is pretty cool. That would be very useful for an RPG server, actually, um, where you actually have to ask someone about uh, their name or something. So uh, that's pretty cool that you can do that. And obviously, and uh, N or M is underline. I think it's N. It might be one of them. Anyway, that is how you do it in-game, but we are going to have a quick look at the config files to see how we can edit them. So here we are in the colored tags folder and as you can see there are four different files. So let's go ahead and look at the colors one to begin with. This is pretty useful if you don't know all these format codes. So as you can see here are all the different colors. Um, my favorite one is definitely the and B which is a nice aqua cyan color. And then we have the formatting codes here. So bold, the uh, squiggly one that uh, hides your name, the uh, strike through, underline and italic. So let's go into the main config file here. Uh, not too much in here. So there's the auto refresh. There is uh, change tab name. So if you hit tab as well, it will update that uh, to show your prefix as well. That's pretty cool. And if we go into the groups file, you can add all of your groups here. I've only got one um, user group at the moment because um, I just installed permissions X quickly. But if you want to obviously add the other bit, you can uh, add the name part and a suffix if you want to and obviously you can copy and paste this and make brand new uh, brand new ranks so maybe you have a donator one and if you create one here make sure you name it the same as in your permissions x or group manager or whatever pex plugin you use finally we have the players file and obviously this is where various players are saved so my other account we are messing around with him and this is his name tag. Obviously you could change it in here if you want to. And make sure you don't make it too long as well. So that is everything in the uh, config files. Pretty straightforward to edit. And it's just a really cool plugin to improve your server. So subscribe, like, comment, and I'll see you next time.